Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Satori Genzo and welcome back once more to Fallout 4. I'm just staring Taking at the Predwin. No, I can do it. Ah, oh, I've killed several by myself. It's okay. Alright, we're gonna talk to uh, Proctor Ingr Ingram? Yeah. So, I bet you're eager to get your hands dirty on our new project. How much has Maxon told you about it? Mm, nothing. Project Why all the secrecy? We're pouring every resource we have into this thing. We can't risk tipping off the Institute. For now, the fewer people that know about it, the better. Come on, it's this way. Unless you're blind as a bat, and I'm sure you've noticed that we've been building a gantry in Tarmac. Maxon and Kells have been looking for something that'll tip the balance when we go toe to toe with the Institute. I kind of noticed. Be a big beast, but she's not built for fighting. That's where our new project comes in. Your new project that's not so new because it's been around. You know, I just kind of realized something. This storage bay full of parts is what's left of Liberty Prime. The Brotherhood used it in the Capital Wasteland as a weapon against the Enclave. Whoa. It's the most advanced robot the Brotherhood has ever had. Cool. Fortunately, Liberty Prime was destroyed in the line of duty. I've yeah, spent that's the true. Part of the last few years piecing him back together. And if you think that was easy, try rebuilding a protectron while you're blindfolded. Okay, In that's cool. Liberty Prime fully operational. We're going to need your help. All right, what do you need? No problem. I'm sure this only looks worse than it actually is. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had your confidence because this is not going to be easy. Oh now, shit. The good news that we've got most of Prime's parts fully assembled. The bad news is that it's going to take more than a few rivets and some spot welding to get them working again. Oh, the no. first problem is his CPU. It's fragile. And every time we try to feed power to it, it blows itself out. Has to be a way. It does sound hard. You can fix it. Power problems? Why is the power blowing out his CPU? Liberty Prime has a highly complex power system. A good deal of that system was damaged when he exploded. So I'm working in the dark trying to come up with parts on my own. Luckily, you were able to convince Ooh. Dr. Madison Lee to return to the Brotherhood. She was on the original build team for Liberty Prime a little over a decade ago. Oh, wow. I've already spoken to her, but she's reluctant to work on Prime for some reason. If you could get her down here to lend a hand with his power system, we can get the big guy moving. Sure thing, Ingram. Now, there's something I wanted to point out about Proctor Ingram. If I could just get her to stop. Pro uh, Proctor Ingram. Proctor. Proctor. Hold on. I wonder if I can talk to her. Tell Dr. Lee we need her help. Yeah, okay. Notice something about Proctor Ingram. I noticed it. And now I, I understand why she's always in this, uh, in this suit of power armor. She lost her legs. Look, she's only got partial legs. They don't come down to the knees and stuff in the power armor. Our vertebrae she, should give us the air. So she lost her legs. So yeah, Proctor Ingram is an amputee, which makes sense as to why she's never out of her power armor then. Oh. Cause I was just about to say, when they're in that power armor frame, you can see their legs, and then I just realized, that's like, wait, I've never seen her out of it, and then, I don't even know what made me look at her legs, and it's like, I don't see legs, what the hell, and then it dawned on me, it's like, oh my god, she's lost her legs, that's why she's in that. Very smart of them to do that for her, you know, put her in, uh, power armor and let her, let her go, but still. And now I understand why Dr. Leon wouldn't talk to me when I was here earlier. She probably knew I had something to say Attention. to her and didn't want to Delta talk. Delta Team Lead, report to the bridge. Delta Team Lead to the bridge. Yeah, Delta Team. Ah, uh, oh, that health. Is there a radiation that I don't know about? Is that it? Alright, I'll do that. If you're here to talk me into working on Liberty Prime, you can forget it. Whoa! Change my mind. Nothing changed my mind. I promised you I'd return to the Brotherhood, and I've kept my end of the bargain. 
Should I remind you? Do I'm... I need to remind you why you made that promise in the first place? Of course not. But you neglected to mention oh. that I'd be asked to work on Liberty Prime. I've been I down this road with didn't the know. Before. Why would I make the same mistake twice? Because you'd be saving the... <sighs> because... Because we care what happens to the Commonwealth. You may not like the Brotherhood, but the people of the Commonwealth shouldn't have to suffer for it. You know, if anyone else wearing a Brotherhood of Steel uniform said something like that, I'd laugh in their face. But coming from you, it sounds like you actually mean it. Tell because Dr. I do. Ingram to get her scribes ready. It's going to take a hell of a lot of work to get Liberty Prime back online, but we'll get it done. Nice! I convinced her even though I failed. Alright, I'm gonna go. All right, let's run. Run! Nah. I wish you could jump down that hole. I wish there wasn't an invisible barrier there that creates a load screen. Also, by the way, it's not that they're shielding in front of this. The windows are just that dirty that it looks like they're shielding in front of it. Hmm. <laughs> some Jameson smearing off, and just fucking good wine. That's some good fucking wine. Not just any good fucking wine. Just fucking good one. It's a horrible sales pitch. Don't don't listen to me. I'm fucking nuts. I'm fucking mad with power. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Oh shit. Sorry, bro. Didn't mean to. Well, I thought you were gonna get shot by my gun. If you don't stop talking about people like that, it's not nice. Ah, <sighs> people. Liberty Prime. I can't wait to hear Liberty Prime speak again. That's that's the most happy part. I want to hear Liberty Prime speak again. Liberty Prime activated. Communism detected. That ah, the Liberty Prime jargon always made me Happy. Pro oh, so this was the assembly stage for Liberty Prime. I didn't realize that's what you meant by that. Oh, he's not as tall as I remember. Proctor Ingram? Wow, things are off to a good start. Isn't that right, Doctor? I hope so. Prime suffered some significant damage to his memory core. I wish your people would have been a bit more careful, Proctor. The good news is that the damage isn't irreversible, and I should be able to get the power flowing into his CPU core without overloading. If uh, your people stay out of my way, that is. Charming, isn't she? Oh, I know, right? Total bitch. Teacher manners! This was a mistake. I'll come back later. Sorry, Sorry about that, Ingram. Don't worry about it. We might be butting heads on a few issues, but I've dealt with worse. Besides... Dr. Lee's worth all the I just realized she we're keeps tools like right here in her power armor. I, see it getting any better I wondered what this word for and I realized it's like, oh no, that's a hammer so handle well. and a We're screwdriver handle. Building his electromagnetic actuators. Sure. Anything, you, Anything need. you need. That's what I love about you. You're ready to leap into action, and I bet you don't have the faintest idea what I'm talking about. The actuators are what allows <laughs> Liberty Prime. I, lo to I love her. Prime's new limbs are way too heavy for the simple hydraulic pistons he had in the past. We're gonna have to rip those out, construct a brand new system using electromagnets, and install them in his limbs. What we need you to do is build the actuators for us. Now that you know what the actuators are, you need to know how to make them. These are the plans and the materials list. Don't lose them. Now before you get that look on your face, you'll be happy to know that we have plenty of the raw materials on that list right here at the airport. The only thing we need you to head out and find is a high-powered magnet. According to Proctor Quinlan, the best place to find one is in any of the ruined hospitals around the Commonwealth. We've already set yeah, up an MRI machine. Yeah, an MRI machine. The high-powered magnets you'll need. They should be back by the time you return. Once you start building the actuators, we need one for each limb, so you'll need to make a total of four. Good luck. You disgusting. Not much of a sight yourself. Okay, so locate a high-powered magnet. I don't know if I can locate a high-powered magnet with those tits in my face. Just saying. Locate a high-powered magnet. Um, yeah. Why is it always Medford Hospital? 
I swear to God, every time I gotta go searching for something at a hospital for the Brotherhood, it's always Medford Hospital. Always. It's never like South Boston or or uh, North Concord. It's always this place. Oh, synths don't attack me now? No, because they know I work for them. In a, well, in a sense. Cool! I don't get attacked by synths no more. Sweetness. Someone died here. All right, let's get this magnet hunt over with. People, 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 people. All right. Huh? What's that? Got a Bam! Oh, I hear something. How do I control the elevator? I just closed Nick in the elevator doors. What is it? Now that you people royally, you know, pissed me off. Now the suicider's not down here anymore. Every time I come in here, there's a suicider and a dog. A mutant dog right there, and they're always causing problems. There we go. That's it. Oh god. Oh god. Reload faster. Reload faster. Oh, gun like down his throat. Bam. And fire again. Bam. Bam! Ah, oh, I love this thing. It's so OP, but it's so cool. Health injection. Ooh. Oh, 105 damage. High powered magnet. Construct four electromagnet actuators. Yeah, now it's time to go back. Whee! Boom. Yeah, that hurt a little. Not too bad, though. Alright. We're gonna try and make some progress. 
I hate waiting, I hate waiting, I really do, really do, but sometimes these load screens take too long and that's what they're doing right fucking now. I knew by the time I was done singing something stupid like that, it would be like, oh, I'm fixed. God, my nose is still freaking bothering me. The inside of my nose is like so dried up and flaking that it's like really fucking bad. It's making it really hard for me to breathe properly. Alright. can't believe you travel with that synth. Yeah, I do. Deal with it. God. Alright. Wait a minute, what the hell? Oh! Ugh, God damn it. It's the construction thing on the other side. Ugh. Ugh, you people suck. Put this gun away, I don't need it right now. With the brotherhood behind us, we'll never fall. Yes, pa Paladin Dance, I, I, I know. Oh, that's a new painting. My power armor's still here. Okay, wise. Um. Okay, so what, I just build them and leave them lay there? Oh, she's probably gonna come get them. You should make good time when the weather's this clear. If you yep. have a moment. If I have a moment? Call it in dance. Ready to, con Ready to continue our mission, soldier? That depends. How are you feeling? My power armor systems are within normal operating parameters. So I'm as ready as I'll ever be. You just give the word, and we can begin our mission. Uh, okay, not, not now. now. No problem. Let me know when you're ready. I get it. You're sad because Unless I've been. Like getting shot, never turn your I'm probably gonna bring Dance with me when for a little while. Proctor Ingram. That's Ingram's all four best. actuators delivered and done. Nice work. Right on schedule. I've completed the restoration of Prime's basic functions, and he's ready to go. In fact, it's getting difficult to explain to the system why it can't move right now. Well, as soon as my scribes get those actuators in place, we'll have his arms and legs installed in no time. Which brings me to your next assignment. It won't be uh -oh. long before Prime can walk and talk, but he's missing one last important element. His nukes. Without them, his offensive systems aren't operating uh -oh. at capacity. <sighs> Prime's weapons, huh? What's Prime armed with? Prime has two weapon systems, his eye laser and his nuke pack. The eye laser can target a hostile from hundreds of yards out and take it down with pinpoint accuracy. His nukes are modified Mark 28 nuclear bombs. They used to drop the things from bombers during the war. Just one of the nukes is equivalent to about three or four fat man shells. Basically, whatever it hits isn't getting up again. His eye laser is almost ready to go, but without nukes to load into his pack, he's fighting at less than half his capability. I'll run down to the Super Duper Mart and pick some up. Hmm, cute. <laughs> <Are they? laughs> I had Prime's to do it. The bomb pack is fitted for Mark 28 nuclear bombs, the same type of bombs that were dropped from aircraft during the Great War. The Commonwealth was a major staging area for the military's uh -oh. air force, so we assumed we wouldn't have trouble finding them. But since we arrived, our scouting teams haven't located a single bomb. That's going to be a problem. Without a fully loaded nuke pack, Prime won't have the firepower to take on the Institute. Agreed. She's right. Of course she's right. But before you give up hope, there's actually a silver lining here. Proctor Quinlan has located some records regarding a military installation, which was used as a nuclear weapons storage facility. 
we're fairly certain this included a stockpile of the Mark 28s. The catch is that the installation is located somewhere within the glowing sea. Oh my god. <laughs> Sounds right. like that's our only option. Yep. I only wish I had better information for you, but that Well, I'm going to split this into two episodes. Halen's established a communications point on the frontier of the glowing sea. I suggest you head out there first and establish a signal protocol with her so that the nukes can be airlifted out once you've located them. Hopefully, by the time you've returned, we'll be ready to wake Prime up and you can say hello. Good luck, Knight. Rearming Prime with nukes should get him back to full fighting potential. Alright, anyways, that's where I'm going to leave this episode. I'm going to pick it up right after this, start recording again. But uh, if you all liked it, <clears throat> hit that like button if you want to see more. Hit that subscribe button. As always, I'm Hattori Ginzo signing out, saying good night and good luck.